Let's walk. Okay. Um, welcome, runners, to Bad Hen Plays Cyberpunk 2077. What do you think? Uh. Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Kompeki. Winds are right. Plan's perfect. Job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. You're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V, I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together. Really. Trust me that I got this. You're not worried? Arasaka will flag and scream anyone who's had dealings with your own Well, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much bigger than mine. You tell me who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats? Or a little bedroom plaything like me? I think I see how you know so much about your Nobu. It's simple. Men like Pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex? Biz. And biz only. So, what now? V. Do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. You wanna fuck over our fixer? I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. A useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows. And actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that will cost you your rep. Without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay for sure. I know. Whatever you decide stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with you. Yeah, you have fun with Judy. Uh, yeah. With Judy Woodrow. I don't know why I was thinking Judy Woodrow. Um, reflexes. And then... Uh, I'll put a pool. I'll put a po pool in a coint. Uh, put, a put a point into cool. Let's get this up. Jesus. Uh, so oh, bad English. Um... God, what about assault? I'll go back into assault. Is there anything good on assault? You know what? No. Let's go intel. Uh, mass vulnerability. Alright. And. There. Turns out everyone's recording from Kompeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her match. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that bio shit. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you then. Great. Be there in no time. See you in the city. So, I was thinking of, like... What if... I found, um... A Twitter alternative called uh, Mastodon. Called what? Mastodon. Ah, uh, I've heard mixed things of that so far. Oh, really? Yep. Even technically, Phil earlier today uh -huh. had a video saying like he's heard rumor of people switching to it. He's kind of like, uh, I don't see that happening. <laughs> oh, okay. So I don't know the specifics of that. I just know people have 
kind of had mixed say about it so far. Huh. Well, I mean, because it's just t Twitter. Even, like, everybody's leaving, t like, the, the higher-ups and, like, like net set people are leaving Twitter in droves. Yeah, understandably, though. I mean... And Musk is trying to do everything he can. I think, like, Musk and, um... Uh, Zuckerberg are intentionally killing their social media platforms. Just so they can be free, finally? I think so? Because, I mean, technically, if it hits a low enough aspect and somebody really does want one, they'll just buy them out, and then they enjoy the full freedom while somebody else gets the nightmare. Pretty much. I mean, like, with, with, uh, with all, with all the shit that went down during the elections and all this conspiracy bullshit nonsense that's still is more yeah, than pertinent. As, as long as politics are gonna keep going ridiculous as they are, any social media thing, sorry, any social media thing is gonna have a nightmare. Just, uh, <laughs> yeah, and now you see why I hate social media so goddamn much. Yeah. No, I totally get it. I, I hey. What a dick! I got run over by that prick. Uh, dick. How dare he? Anyway. But, um, uh, but yeah, no, I dabble in social media, but I don't really just hang out. Like, if you were to ever look me up, you'd see, like, oh, you popped into existence for, like, today. But, <laughs> yeah. We haven't seen you for three weeks. About time, Holmes. Yeah. Looks like you just ran a marathon. Something happened? Years of merc work, and yet still sweat like a roasted pig when I duck to my ma. Can't help yourself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life. Oh, baby. <laughs> yeah! We have arrived. The Major Leagues. Does not get any higher, Jim. And you know something else? We fucking earned it, my no. As much as you cherry popped? Yeah, come on! As much as I, I as much as I harp on Jackie, he's one of the better side characters. Yes. Yeah. And he's I really want to gravitate yeah. And I will give CD Projekt Red credit. Told like, they myself. really did try to flesh his ass oh, out. Real? Ah, oh, shit. Well, that must have been ages ago. In the short, t in the short amount of time we have with Jackie. Yeah. No, he, he, he holds a strong memory to even, like, later in the game, you could just be like, Name's oh. Me. This is Jackie Wells. Hmm. <laughs> oh. Is that supposed to sound familiar? It will soon. We're here to see Dex. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? Alright then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, Hey. Grab a seat. We'll be in a sec. Hey. Hard Grab a seat. We'll be in a sec. I'm trying to sit. Right there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can you imagine? Oh, I go there. Boa, boa. Maybe even more than black hair. Looks like we're up. Yeah. Oh, dude. Last hey, night. That lady there. That's Rogue. Best fixer in all the Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? Uh, you order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. You old Johnny Silverhands coming up. Right on, Chica. Somebody did their homework. Looks like the dog ate mine. Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. How long's the afterlife been around? Half a century? Longer. Don't know by how much, though. That'd be the oldest club in Night City. And the most respected. Don't forget that, Ben. 
Say I wanted a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Snap it. Mind-blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. <sighs> what a beautiful tradition. Um. Hmm? Uh, oh, to tonight city. Tonight city. And the yeah. afterlife. Ha <laughs> So, I I'll tell you what happened last night, man. I got, I was so pissed. Who else can I drink here? All on the menu? Oh, yeah, still silly. Except there's a spot. Morgan Blackhead, right? <laughs> True. Morgan's yet to make up his mind if he's dead or still kicking. <laughs> Nobody knows what happened to him. Think he's still alive? It's been years. Why not? Look at Rogue. People from that era? A species unto themselves. Uh. I guess dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. Live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer, oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll remember that. Virgin with Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Dishon, see you now. How do you know? My job? Look around. How do you think Murph's earned their reps? You gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's out. Break a leg. Thanks. So, last night, right, I'm done teaching for the Chinese, for the Chinese school. I decided to go out for a bit. Every time, I'm just like, I want to have a quiet drink to myself. Every woman! I came across as all like, sorry, I'm taken. Or I have a husband. I'm like, I'm not in the mood to look for a woman. Why do you think it got so bad, right? So I was I I was grabbing a bite to eat. And they were just like at like Oh, uh hey, uh please go ahead go ahead. I'm still thinking about what I want to order. Uh, oh, that's oh thanks, but uh I'm I'm married. I'm just like what the fuck? Look, I've been teaching from 10 p.m. till midnight. I just want to quiet. I just wanted to come out with a quiet for a quiet drink. Why is everybody jumping down my throat thinking I'm going after them? Jesus fucking Christ! I was so angry last night. Well, you must go after every aspect of them. Ah, finally! First time in real space. Let's see. And the flathead. Let's see this bad boy. Yeah, I was so angry. No, no, don't go back to that. It's kind of my own personal life. Of certain dating habits lately. Because it's been like... In the city. Mm. Good thing. People have just been to where it's... <laughs> city oh, well, I can only be interested in you for these reasons or for this. But then, if the situation changes, all the things they previously said to you, different. Now, now. Okay. Oh, that whole I'm married, be going over if the circumstance was different and she wanted to, but if it's all right that marriage would have been I'd not. To start with a question the thing is, I made sure I wasn't throwing the vibe that I wanted to, like, you know, get laid or any of that. I just wanted to quite fucking drink. Yeah. But still, that's... It's because that's not what they want. What was that? That's, that's how it happens today. People look I'll at you and be like, oh, inside. that's a person I'll have a drink with. But if in their mind they're going, I'm looking for someone to offer me a drink because I do want to sleep with them, then even if you're not trying to, that's the first thing in their mind. Yeah. Uh, God damn. Talk about a mood. Yeah. 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 Send out mixed signals, so I got mixed feelings. One night, sipping champ paradise with Yorinobu. Next night, chatting it up with regulars at Lizzie's. Worlds don't match up. Struck me, too. You saying we putting two and two together and getting five? Some part of the equation's missing, then. Clearly. That's why y'all gotta fix her. Anyone try to fuck you? They first gotta fuck their way through Dex Deshaun's 300-pound ass. Anything else? Um, 
I don't know if I should rat her out. Should I rat her out? Nah, you can use her later. See what I was about. Alright. Wanted to see what she was about. Huh? How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. What? Oh. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deeds. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. A Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. Goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. Transport to Delamain. Primus Cap Company in All Night City. Not a mind. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The no tell motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. I'm on? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms here. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our soccer defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? How do we get in the penthouse? You're no who's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse secure. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize the Pecky's dweller. Elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Hold on. How do you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Trust me when I say whatever hits you think of, T-Buck solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to take a break. Flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? Okay, you're brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Got the first talent's always the same. I'm negotiable. 30%. We're all 30? Every part of this drama carries its risk. That's the value of yours as determined by me. Uh. Come on, Dex. Isn't that a little low? Hey, hold on, Holmes. Who got the flathead? Who pulled the intel for the brain dance? And we're going in a hotel full of soccer men to swipe some fucking toy from the boss's son. We are the job. Hmm. And who's riding transport? A top tier net runner and a lead proof plan and intel? You sure you want to go down this road? Ugh. Alright, fine. Fine, thanks. Make your point. Wise choice. Last thing, Kempeki's got a strict no iron policy. Security case, the works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride. Take the flat hand inside and its case. Got some death suits, so you'll look the part too. Oh. Thanks, Steve. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eggs? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role. But a week. Tower, I guess. What do we do while we sit around and suck air? You sit tight and pit down, because old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now, as that old Greek dog says, lie to the banquet, so don't go thirsty, don't get drunk. You have a cherry at a wait time. My cue to Delta 2. Got a prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. 
any other issues, now's your chance. You and Dex know each other a while. Um, why? Uh, you know, you'd say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophize in it. No wonder you get along. Plan. What's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury green villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. I'm good. No questions. Let's get to work. Are you ready to get going or what? Mmm. Something I gotta take care of first. Sin problemas. Me too, by the way, I mean. Put on the Militech suit? Just don't forget to suit up. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so we gotta go. Okay. God, I love that suit. They mean action blocked. Oh. How's my iron looking? Uh, that's a better revolver. No, no shotguns yet. Better that. Oh man. What about you, Shotty? Shotty with a wow. Okay then. Never mind. <sighs> Flashbang Bio has Ugly Frag. Enter the Delamain now? Let me see if I can contact. Oh. Okay, never mind. Now it looks like we're doing the Delamain shit. Alright, boy. Sorry, Jackie, you're taking forever. Hey! <laughs> I tried, Jackie. Why, why is ship not, why is sprint not working? Whatever. Wait, what? Um, what? Oh. The, the map was acting weird. The, rather, the radar was acting weird. Oh, whatever. Let's do this. My systems inform me that we await one other passenger. Yep, on his way. Catching up. Um... Oh, there he is. Yeah, I'm guessing he's putting the shit behind the in the trunk. Okay then. <laughs> Delamain, 
Initiate combat mode. My apologies, but you do not appear to be in any sort of imminent danger. Huh. Oh well. Trust me. I'm all down in army of Zakanitas if it comes down to it. Uh is combat mode even legal? Of course it is. The Second Amendment says so. Why on the board you are entirely within your rights to ban and use me? Excelsior, what else is included? Comprehensive health coverage, including the handling and disposal of a client's remains should death occur on board. Now, you got back pretty quick. That ain't skimping, is he? He's taking 70% of the pot. Or have you forgotten already? Excelsior. This is how you want to cruise into the major leagues. You wouldn't get overly excited. Hmm? Have we gotten there? Not yet. No, Jack. That feels like you're losing that steel grip of yours. Huh. Seems to me like it's you who's got some kind of problem. You need you to keep your head clear and in the game. You've got a job to do. It's never, ever been clear in my whole fucking life. Let me explain something to you, V. My whole life I've spent in this shit around us. And I ain't going back. I'm nearing our destination. Wow. Yeah. You're... <laughs> We'll be, uh, pulling up to the hotel soon. Listen, set up a direct encrypted line to guide you to the Pecky. Be ring Jackie now, see if we're in sync. Can't be too careful. And? Hmm. Got static. Say something, look. The greatest crimes issue from a desire for excess and not from necessity. Say what now? Aristotle. Guess you read me then. Yeah, I read you. Not so much you read. Kind of exciting. Could give it some thought. Try to understand. How about you, Pete? No more hours, Adam. Fuck off, both. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Take uh, checks out. Looks like. Then I'm gonna let you see. Stay in touch. Thank you for choosing the designated service. And best of luck. I shall wait here for your return. It's finally happening. Almost forgot. No iron, huh? Jeez, Jackie, will you stop? Right. We get it. You're gonna die. You don't have to, like, fucking project so hard. <laughs> like, it wasn't even, like, uh, it wasn't even, um... It wasn't even, like, even in the first playthrough when I was first playing this, I was like, Jesus Christ, it, it, he really wants to die. Bye. stop this? Reservations in your name, Ramon. Welcome to You're the there to meet Hajime Taki, military tech department rep. Papers are for the flathead. Don't worry. Got this. Welcome to Kapaki Plaza. Please come through single file. You got it, home. Uh, <clears throat> sir. Oh! Just dry up! <clears throat> Got something. Dare to explain why you're bringing military equipment onto the premises into Kapeki Plaza? We're arms dealers. Excuse me? Ah, you are here to see Pakistan. Am I right? Please, accept my apologies for the confusion. <laughs> you should only take a moment, sir. Go ahead. Yokoso. Greetings and welcome to Kompeki Plaza. I always, we like. I always thought those things looked weird. Of course, just a moment. Yeah. The name on the reservation is Victorino. Double room, two adults, one night, correct? That's the one. Perfect. I'll go ahead and notify Pakistan of your arrival. Shit, no good. Not part of the plan. Talk her up, please. Stop. That won't be necessary. We'll go freshen up first. We'll refine ourselves. But Pakistan is expecting you. No? 
Senorita, you know how long we've been traveling? 18 hours from New Barcelona. With the delay on Medici, because some cider cycle blew himself into bits inside the terminal. Oh, a nightmare. Of course, I understand. You'll be in a lapis lastly suite on level 42. Oh, one more little formality. Please validate your SID chip. Others all yours, Harry. Everything seems to be in order. We wish you a pleasant stay. Thank you. We're going to have to end it here. And there you have it, runners. Tune in next week for Mad Hen Plays Cyberpunk 2077. Yes. Boom. All right. Now that that's...